All right, I think this cop is gonna approach me. He's probably checking my my uh, tags. And he's gonna come on over and give me a hard time. All right, here he comes. Hey. Hey, how you doing? Deputy yep. Garcia. Okay. Your window roll down? What? Does your window roll down? It does, but so what? Well, I don't want you opening the door. What's the matter? My hands are right here. All right. Um, you so see them? Somebody from the. What's the matter with opening? What's the matter with opening the door? Don't stop pushing on my door. I'm just holding it. I don't want you to get out the vehicle. I don't want the door open. What is this? A traffic stop or something? I'm here because the city of Victor called and said you were in their building taking pictures. The city hall. The city of Victor. The city hall, right? Yeah. So what? Well, I'm just, they wanted me to come by, they thought it was suspicious, they wanted to make sure you're okay. Yeah, well, alright. What's the big deal about taking pictures? That was like... Nothing, but because they called 911, I have to stop and say hi. Okay, that was a few hours ago too, did you stop by earlier? No, they just called dispatch about seven minutes ago. That's incredible. They Maybe they had a camera inside that they looked at later? Maybe, I don't know. What's the matter with me getting out? I just, in the state of Colorado, we don't like you getting out of the vehicle. Because? It's an officer safety issue. Okay, but so I mean, so we what? Like, we like you to stay in the vehicle, and that's what they train us to do, okay? <sighs> so, did you have any weapons on you when you are in there? Is there anything why? You see my hands. Yeah, I know. I said when you were in there. Is there any reason why somebody would think you were suspicious while you were videotaping and taking well, pictures? Well, I mean, I don't know who's who's the complainant. I, I'd like right to... now it's the city of Victor. Yeah, yeah, but there's a person. It's not like an entity. So, yeah, like they, I, I mean, I understand how corporations are considered people, but, I mean, there's still a person who's operating the corporation. So, I mean, whoever's uh, in charge of the city of Victor, whoever's representing them, I'm talking so, about the ambassador. Yeah, I don't, so who's, I who's, don't know what employee called, dispatched in a telephone. Because I'll say, I'll say what happened, like, after I left, they asked me if I was looking for somebody. Uh -huh. And I was like, somebody, no. I was just looking, and you got a nice building. You know you know what I'm talking about, right? The yeah. city hall? It right. looks nice on the outside, so... All right, cool. Well, check this out, man. You ain't break no law. I just wanted to make sure you aren't doing that suspicious, so you have a good day. I'm going to close the door. All right? Okay, okay, go ahead. You're allowed to take pictures and video. Yeah. I don't know why the fuck they would call us. Fifth but Amendment. I have to come. Or, I mean, the First Amendment or whatever. Yeah, yeah. I know. I know. So, okay. I had to come by because they reported as suspicious, but you yeah. take well, pictures and video, and I have no reason to stop you. You have a good day, okay? Okay. All right, just comments on this uh, police interaction. I went to the grocery store, and there was three guys talking who looked like they were possibly city workers. Now that I think of it, they had neon green uh, jackets or shirts, and they were staring at me very intently. As they were talking, every time I looked at them, it started angering me. I bought some sausage and eggs, and I popped my popcorn at the microwave. So I sat at the microwave for like two minutes, and then also another minute at the for the warming up the sausage. And then I didn't look at them that whole time. And then as I was leaving, I just kept glancing at them, and they kept staring at me. As I was leaving, they left, and one of them drove a light green lime truck uh in my direction he passed my car while i was sitting in it and then he a few minutes later passed my car again and then lo and behold a few minutes later the cops show up so it looks like maybe these guys had witnessed me witnessed me inside the city hall somehow either they were in there at the time. I didn't even notice. I was just kind of recording um, the the stuff around the city hall, or maybe they looked at a camera or something to uh, to identify me. I wore the, all the same clothes, so they could positively identify me. I don't know how else they would have uh, gotten the cop to come straight to my car and ask me if I was recording in the city hall like two hours ago. Okay. 
this is like a long time in, in, in between the actual me being in City Hall and the cop showing up and asking me about recording in City Hall. It really looks like there's these guys at that grocery store. Had I not gone to the grocery store to get some food, then I guess there would have been no cop later com coming to stop at my car. Uh, that's that's the only way thing I, I can only sense I can make of it is is uh, these possibly city workers in the grocery store um, like ratting me out as being suspicious. All right, let's see if city hall's open now. Nope. All right. That's cool. All right. TV. Thank <laughs> you. 